Hi everyone, this is Anthony Giuliano with the Fort Wayne Trails Board and I'm continuing my quest to do all 120 miles of Fort Wayne Trails in the year 2020. And tonight with me I have a very special guest. Mayor Tom Henry is with me tonight. Hi Anthony. We just sent Trek the Trails off <laughs> yes, we did. on a Tuesday night ride. Mayor Henry, thanks for being with us tonight. Got a few questions for you. I wanted to start by saying, you know, during your administration, there's been great trail development, we have a great trail system. Why do you believe that's important to the community? Well, anymore, Anthony, employers are looking for things beyond the financial incentives that we put together, especially if they're looking to bring potential employees into our city. They've got to offer more than just incentives for themselves. They've got to offer something for their staff. So by increasing the quality of life in our community, it can be a real good economic driver. So we figured one of the ways to do it, besides uh, looking at housing stock, is to create an atmosphere where they can not only enjoy our city through walking and jogging and bicycling, but in some cases, it's what they use for transportation to work by foot. Uh, so we're working real hard to try to have some connectivity throughout our city, and uh, it seems to be working. Let's talk a little bit about the future then. Obviously, I'm selfish as a board member for Fort Wayne Trails. I want more trails. Right. What's your vision for trail development? What do you see happening next with Fort Wayne Trails? Well, actually, I have two visions. One is to complete the trail system within our city, reaching out into the county. And that's going to mean a concentration on south, southeast. We've done pretty well southwest and north, northwest. Uh, we're doing pretty a pretty good job, but south, southeast, we're still struggling with a little bit, uh, primarily because of the density. A lot of the homes are close together. We don't really have a lot of open space to develop trails. We're working on it, but it's just proved to be a, a challenge. But that's short term. Long term, I do want to someday be able to be a part of the trail system from Pokagon State Park down to Wabash State Park in Bluffton. So that's from Angola to Bluffton. I think that's about 80 to 85 miles. Wouldn't that be a statement for our community? Yeah, that would be a big day on a bike. Yeah, it sure would. <laughs> An even bigger day on foot. <laughs> for sure. Thank you all for coming tonight. This is exactly the reason that we do this, so we can have as many people as possible enjoy our trail system. Take care of yourselves, have fun, be safe, and thanks for enjoying our trail. God bless you all. Well, Mayor Henry, I know that you and Cindy like to stay active. What's your favorite stretches of trail? Where do you like spending time? Well, I like the Rock Hill Park area. Uh, I've driven, driven, driven it several times uh, from there out to the Lutheran area and back. Uh, I just like that towpath trail. I, I just think it's, it's neat. You go through neighborhoods, uh, you go by schools, uh, you just get a good exposure to different parts of our city. Uh, now that doesn't take away from uh, other parts of our community. The, the trail system now out by Purdue University, and you, were, I just, you and I were talking earlier about DuPont Road yeah. in the Solomon Park area. Really, the more you ride the trails, uh, the more uh, you like the trails. And as a result, your, your, uh, your favorite areas sometimes change. Yeah. So, but right now, it's Rock Hill. Yeah, I, I said that after doing the 120 and 2020, it's all my favorite. I like all of it. <laughs> exactly. So. Well, thanks, Mayor. We really appreciate you coming out. Thanks for everything you do for trails. Really appreciate it. Anthony, my pleasure. Thank you.